Doc Carter. Hi, guys! Hi! And, and you know what my brother being in here means? It is Sibling Saturday! Yay! That's good! And for your viewing pleasure, because you know we love video games. We're, of course we do! We're gaming siblings. Yes, we are! We've been gaming since I was able to pick up a controller and say he cheated. Yes, he did. Yeah. I'll never forget it. It was Mortal Kombat. That was not my fault. Lies! The filthy earth boy lies! <sighs> Memories. <laughs> anyway, you see the title of this video. We are reacting to Final Fantasy VIII Remastered trailer. And it's coming out September 3rd. So for all those that are Final Fantasy fans... That are Final Fantasy VIII diehard fans. Yeah. It comes out September 3rd. Yeah. Okay, here we go. We're watching it. We're ready. Let's do it! Okay. Sorry. I had a little funny moment. You know what I'm saying? With my face. <laughs> Sorry. Well, it was 20 years ago, wasn't it? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, that's good. The world fell in love. Sure did. With a timeless place. God almighty, you have no clue. Yeah, he couldn't dance at all, y'all. He sucked. Yeah, he's pretty bad. And a hopeless, hopeless case for Look this. romance. Oh, they're being, bringing Ifrit back to brotherly love. Ah, so! Valium Garden. Oh my god. Hi, Earth! Yes. Sophie! Zell. Lenora. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm so happy. Mm, I remember that battle. Ah! Oh, girl, I could not stand you! Ah! Service. Oh! We all remember that! Oh. oh my god! Oh my god! The chill was ridiculous when he died. Oh, but that died. reach of love. Oh. How could you not? Oh my god! Ah! Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> it is on. Here okay, we go. now we're doing the trailer analysis and comparison. And this is by a YouTube channel called JRPG Central. So Yes, it was uploaded two months ago. So if you haven't seen it between now and then, so anyway, to get uh, started, let's kind of scroll look. back through this trailer here. There are a few things I want to take a look at before we do the actual direct comparisons. Um oh. When you do Man, these games, those limit bricks were games. relentless! Oh, God, Final the Fantasy memories. VII, this was kind of an issue on the PS4. If you don't remaster the environments as well as the actual models, you, you get basically this. This is a really good example. Oh my God. You get this really nice, high-quality model on top of just a bunch of blurry, awful backgrounds. Yeah. Not, not to start this off negative or anything, but... I do Dude, it's too that late. You're not starting I mean, look at pretty the much. Like, it's really. so detailed here. It looks great. And then the rest is just kind of meh, you know? Meh. Yeah. Um, obviously, in the forest, these, these trees are just atrocious. And there's only so much you can do at, at certain points. But the actual models, like Selfie here, looks, looks fantastic. She sure does. I've heard some people say that their initial reactions, they didn't find it to be that impressive. They... They, honestly, I heard some people say they couldn't tell the difference, which to me is crazy because I had How do you not tell the difference? Are you serious? And, and in their defense, maybe they hadn't played the game in a while, and this is probably just how they remembered it looking. But if you actually directly compare the graphics like we're about to, you'll see that that's most certainly not the case. Um, so let's just go ahead and get started here. Uh, give me just one minute to kind of line this up once I do. be good. This is also a different format. I'm doing this live, like on the fly. Uh, I thought it'd be kind of a fun thing to do. We'll see how it works out. You guys might hate it. If you do, let me know. No, we're good. Come on, man. Just we're good. Um, do you think? So here's Squall. And, uh, yeah. Look at the difference. Exactly the same. At all. 
the details in both him and like say the sword or in his face basically you can see everything you can see his necklace clearly and let's kind of go forward a little bit to the actual winter breaks because here's another thing i want to talk about i want to talk about uh the fonts and what they're what how they look like in the game Does that sound like a Pardon me, kids well, in the Final background, IX, just getting off of school, know. you know and what I'm saying? Maybe so this wasn't as big kids. of a deal for some people, but for me, I'm good on the Final Fantasy IX Remaster. I will just play my PS1 copy or my PS1 Classic copy on my Vita or PSP. Uh, it just looks awful. They ported the mobile version for the PS4 version and for the Switch and Xbox One version. So it's literally, oh, it's a port of a port, okay. and it just Good doesn't look good. In fact, I'll pull up some, some comparisons here. Uh, and again, it's a tiny thing. It might sound like a nitpick. Nitpick? Words? Definitely nitpick. But the whole... It just kind of gives the game a really cheap mobile vibe. Like, even the menus... Uh, don't yeah. Did it look like this on the mobile? Did you play it on the mobile? I did. Anyway, I'm getting it off was top. Horrible. Was it? I'm like, look how good this looks. I and mean, I mean, this technically looks cleaner, but it's just really plain and just bland. Um, again, this is like, Final Fantasy IX, and I'm getting way off topic, but Final Fantasy IX had this really, really nice font here, you can see, did I just, it just really fit the aesthetic of the game. I'm about to say, that was like Final Fantasy IX for a second. Yeah, he said that as well. I'm still anyway, like, getting over it, you guys, I'm sorry. Uh, that was my first thing, it might sound funny, but that was my first thing that my eyes went to was the UI and the fonts to see if it matched up, and... While not exactly the same, they got pretty damn close. Look at the close. details this, in the sword. These two are really comparable. Um, it's not until you. It really, is really when you're really talking about like, fonts. Oh, but, you know, font you're talking about the minute exactly stuff. The same, like the here that kind of um, that, uh, that overall, really does show to, improvement that? on the game. So, Actually, fonts is something. You know, Overall, the UI that a lot of people look at. For some reason, um, in the trailer, like uh, he's talking about the, um, the background, the how it's blurred, it. but yet all the character models are real anyway. crisp, um, clean, sharp. Crisp and clean um, and um, definitely the accurate the um, oh, models the towards the old game, not taking away from it. Uh, now, I would not be upset. If they completely redid the whole entire thing and made the characters um, less boxy and more human-like, um, I know that would take a whole lot more from the game as far as you know all the you know the, the, the gameplay. You know, I, mean, I understand all that. But I wouldn't mind if they and did like a Final looks, Fantasy uh, 8 and then they did a spin-off. Sure. Um, you can actually tell she has a necklace now. As Excuse me. A I was, yeah. her but see, look at Renoa as, as far as far as from when we first got it 20 years ago to now. Uh, yeah, her bangs are actually more fuller. It's not the four spike that's great. going down. Exactly. Nice. And you can actually tell she has something on her arm. Like a wrist or like a um an arm ribbon, and uh you can actually tell she's wearing a necklace. You can see she actually has a nose. Like um, it's it's it looks good. Like it really looks good. It just looks like something that's actually on her arm instead of something that's just painted on there. I mean, like no shade against the original game. We both fell in love with it, which is why we are so excited for this. But. The crisper, cleaner version no, looks amazing. You can tell the details in the person. You can tell the details in the model a little bit more. Uh, moving on to but, um, would not mind, you know, the upgrade in the backgrounds during the fight scenes. Yeah. You know that that would make improve. it like yeah, make it look more um, like my there's trees. Nothing, there's nothing so wrong with that. So kind of but um, still, <laughs> I mean, it was I'm looking PS4 forward one. to it. Not too much of a disappointment. Yeah, me too. You can only expect uh, but really so good. much when she it comes really to um, her hair um, a lot like of these remasters. Like yeah, so like it took them a while to bring back, because at first it was like some years ago, we were waiting on Final Fantasy VII to be remastered. We all got the trailer. We were so happy about it. I was jumping up and down for joy. I was so annoyed. But then they stopped production because they had to fix everything. 
so annoying. That was annoying for a lot of us Final oh Fantasy. Oh my gosh, look at Zell. Zell looks, Zell looks good. Zell has a baby face. Zell always had a baby face. Yeah. But my thing was his baby face was more grown in the actual game. They gave him more of a structure and jawline. And here they actually rolled him off a little more in the jawline and made him... Um, get out, Munchkin. Get out. Go play. I love you. Thank you, sweet pea. You're still here. Kill. You're ruining my, my conversation. <laughs> like, I love the tattoo, it's the detail of this tattoo. It's not as bulky. You see that? Like, if you see no, that one right actually, there. There's actually more to it um, on the new one versus the old one. Because on the old one, they only had the one line on the forehead. Yeah. But... Ooh, excuse me. On the new one, they have two on the forehead instead of just one. Yep. The earth looks good. The earth looks good. What I'm noticing here with it is the fact that you can see he has detailed fingers, but you don't see it on the updated version. See that? Yeah, but if you look at, you know, his gun, too, where his hands is placed on the gun, you can tell that they're detailed and spread apart. Yeah. Whereas on the old game, you couldn't really tell they were always together, you know. They were like, always talking like this. this like I don't this. appreciate you doing this, and you know I'm not even trying to point at you with one finger, but all my fingers are together. Ah! Like so, in retrospect, yeah. all the characters look good. You know who I really want to see the character model be upgraded to? I want to see um, Adina, Sorceress Adina. No, that's uh, Adina. Adina. Or Adia. Adia. Get her name right. She's as hard a name to say as Aerith. Some red on the Yeah, they've changed his jacket. Unless, so, obviously, his gloves changed because those were his weapons, I believe. Yeah, they changed it from red to black. Well, no, those were later on weapons that they used. Oh, yeah, that's right, that's right. After you upgrade, those are actually the starter. But they actually did change some of his outfit features. They changed his jacket, I see that. You know, actually, I don't know what's going on with his PS1 jacket. That actually doesn't make sense. It looks like it's like an under jacket. I see the flame, the flame comparison. No, what it is, it's like a muscle shirt, one of those tight muscle shirts. And then they put like a cut off, like he didn't... Either way, oh, well, no. It, it looks like he got, like, a vest jacket, and the bottom of it is, like, a layer, and then the top black part is, like, the upper yeah, layer. Like, I always thought it was just, like, you know, a tank and a jacket. That's what I always thought it was. So, that probably That's that Valium uniform. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I got you, Zell. I got you. I want to see Sid. I want to see, um, who else? Cypher. Um, who else? No, I, you know who I want to see? The Guardian oh, Forces. Really good yes! I want to see know, them. I want to see uh, Ifrit. I want to see Shiva. The GFs. Oh, gosh, yes. I want to see, oh, the Siren. Yes! The, you know who I, I want to really see? I want to see Odin. I want to see Odin. Yes! Bahamut. Oof. Boy. That's going to be lit. I am excited for this. You guys have no idea. No idea. So I got it. Looks good. Again, pretty damn close. I think it looks really good. Uh, we already looked at Renoa. Uh, did we look at uh, Pistis? No, we did not look at Pistis. Or was that another thing? I did, I did one recording and then lost the footage. Pistis looks great. Yeah, she actually looks like an instructor with a lot of her facial expressions now in the newer one versus the old one. Yeah, she's um, just like a blank stare. Like, I actually she just threw stuff on instead of, you know, her no outfit grammar. being being thought out. <laughs> Sorry. She just doesn't like to be told to go away. Even though that's not what I said. I 
fig on his room. Like, you can actually tell she has a belly button. Whereas in the PS1, like on the PS1, you can't tell. Like you just see that her midriff is also is just showing, but you don't see she has a belly button. She has one right there. Her nose is very pronounced in the remastered, and I love that. Oh man, okay, listen. Some things you're allowed, you should be allowed to get away with. Font should be one of them, okay? You're updating the font. You're not using the back in the back in the day Windows 98 font. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you should be able to get away with some things. Font should be one of them. Now, you don't want to get too terribly dysfunctional with it, but, you know, sometimes you can only use what you got. To the fans who have been waiting, patiently! Oh, Jesus. I'm living for it. Living! Oh, regard. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they brought it back. Ooh wee. Now see, they redid some of the videos. Yes, the cut scenes, see. Which looks really good. I know everything's going to be the same as far as soundtrack. I just hope the updated graphics, the updated attacks, the updated character models, it's going to blow everybody out the water. And I can't I'm wait. expecting a lot of the soundtracks to be in high definition. Oh, yeah. Which is really going to give you that fullness of sound if you're wearing, like, Turtle Beaches or whatever other gaming headphones. Or if you got a really good, good surround sound system. So, Just saying. Now, this is coming to Nintendo Switch, um, Steam, um, PS4. Uh, Xbox One. And Xbox One. And um, I have Steam. So guess who's playing online? I have PS4. Guess who's really playing online? That'd be Xbox. I like I can play it on both and I don't really care. Yeah, that's true. Thank you guys for tuning in with us. I actually have a lot to do. So, we are going to take this time to say thank you for viewing Sibling Saturday. It's Sibling Saturday, and guys, I'm so happy about this game. You both are. Yep. As 90s kids, I played these games constantly, and then beat the game, and then played them over again just to do it again. Judge us not, we did. We actually did. I did. A lot. Yeah, I, I even went back and played it two times, and then went back to play it again. After I brought the strategy back. Which was even more fun because we actually, that was like the whole brother sister bond thing that just. But that only happened on the third time. Yeah. I Over my brother's torso, you see his social media handles, and um. <laughs> and then you see mine as well popping up as well. <laughs> as well. Guys, if you like this video for Sibling Saturday, I know it's been a while since we did a Sibling Saturday video. The last time we did a Sydney Saturday video, we looked at the new Mortal Kombat game, which did not disappoint. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will leave a bubble, subscribe bubble at the end of this video so you can subscribe to my brother. Alright, and I will see you guys later! Alright, see you guys later. We love you. Why are you calling me? <laughs> Bye, guys.